Hey everyone, Alex here from Android Headlines and we're taking a look at how to install Google Mobile Services onto the Smartisan T2 smartphone. So here we have the Smartisan T2. This is a smartphone out of China. It's actually from a new company, newish company called Smartisan. Costs around 380 US dollars converted is 24.99 yuan or Chinese RMB. So there's no Google services on here, obviously because it's for China. Uh, now, as you can see from scrolling through the apps here, there's no Google apps at all. So what we're gonna do is go into the app store, which is right here in the upper left hand corner. Now the writing is in Mandarin, so we don't really know what it says, but we're gonna go into there anyways and then hop over to search and search for Google, which you can see I've already done that. And now in the search results, you're gonna see a bunch of different Google apps, but Google Play is gonna be the third result. You're going to skip that actually, and then go down to another entry, which is also in Mandarin, so you won't know what it says, but the icon has GMS in it, so you can tell it's Google Mobile Services. So we're gonna go ahead and install that real quick. And now that installation is complete, we're gonna hit open. And as you can see on the screen, it says that it's gonna download Google Services Framework, Google Account Management, Google Play Service, Google Calendar, and Contact Synchronization. So we're gonna go ahead and click on, or tap on Download Google Services. And it's about a 45 megabyte uh, package that is downloading. And now it's finished downloading. So we're going to go ahead and install Google Services here. Now installation is going to require a reboot, so we'll have to do that real quick. And of course it's going to come up and ask if you really want to reboot it. You know, that, that typical type of thing you get from smartphones, laptops, everything. So it's going to reboot real quick. And now that it's booted up, we're going to jump into the phone and you'll see on the very last page, you'll see both uh, the Google Play Store as well as the Google Services installer, which we installed already. But now we have the Play Store, so you would just tap on that. I'm going to ask you to log in or create an account, and most of us already have one, so we're going to go ahead and log into our account right here real quick. And it's logging us into our Google account, and Google Contact Sync wants permission, so of course we're going to give that to it. And now we're in the Google Play Store, and that's basically how you get uh, Google Apps onto your Smartest and T2. Now you will still need to install, you know, the typical Google Apps, like Gmail, Hangouts, Pretty much every single thing the only app you have right now is the play store and that's it for this video now uh, if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up as always and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one